Hi everybody, I did not mean to do another video, but uh, three stories to come out after the press conference video, which we've done earlier on the day. Uh, we're going to talk about Quickly Dead. This is a quick video, it's no fancy graphics or, any, graphics or anything. Three things to come out. The major one coming out with is Chancel and Bemba has tweeted, and I presume he's done a note in his phone and, and screenshotted and put it on his Twitter. Quite an emotional statement that he's come out and said. Now it's not, it's quite rare we never hear from Chancel and Bemba. Now obviously we know there's rumours going around, rumours I have to quote, that Rafa's not playing because his English isn't very great and he didn't take under orders back way back in the Wolves game. Now he's come out and said, very emotional I have to say, despite my minimal playing time this season, I am here and I'm not giving up. I continue to train ardently and seriously and I will not give up until I find my place in my team, in the team, sorry. My wish is to come back stronger than ever and satisfy as you, my fans, as I was able to do last season in the Premier League. So that's quite a bold statement. Now, does that enhance his chances or does he does he harm it by putting that out there? He's also went on a quote, Echel Siastes. I don't know what that is, people. So uh, people who are ports inform me who that is or what that is he's quoting. He's went on a quote, better is the end of a thing than its beginning. Better a patient mind than a haunty spirit. Hmm, don't know what that is, or maybe that's Hauntly, maybe. Maybe he's trying to spell Hauntly, maybe he's spelled that wrong. Let us know what that means, I've got no idea what that means, that quote. Um, so yeah, quite that's quite emotional, isn't it? It's quite a, a statement to put out there. It's very rare, we have him chance on them, but very rare he tweets. You only have a tweet of Newcastle have won, or he's going away at the DR Congo and he's played, you know. Um, so let us know what you think of that one. Quite, I was quite blown by that one. Secondly, Huddersfield got smashed tonight 4-0, which has done Newcastle a massive favour. Going into our fixture with Birmingham tomorrow or today, depending on when you're watching this video. Uh, beating 4-0, that opened the door. Like I said in the preview videos, this is Newcastle's, double Newcastle's ch chance now to get three points. This is a surely must win for Newcastle. A win will obviously enhance the gap as well. I know they've got another game in hand, but... This will enhance, it could stretch us to nine points, which will look a lot more healthier for Newcastle. Yes, all ifs and buts. Finally, I'm going to end it with a <laughs> funny one. Stephen Taylor has come out and had a right quote, Sunderland as a place. Stephen Taylor has said, and I quote, Sunderland is a horrible place. That's all over the internet, just search for it. He's come out and had a right go at Sunderland as a city, as a place, as a, as a team. He's went on to say he doesn't like them, they don't like him, um, so on and so on. Now have a look at it, it's all over the internet, it's quite funny, it's all over Twitter around uh, Sunderland fans biting back. But hey, quick video for you, no fancy graphics. Uh, obviously we hope to get three points against Birmingham. Thanks for watching, see you later.